Hello everybody, Hooded Cobra Commander 788 here, and it's time for another Patron's Choice Vote. This is where supporters on Patreon get to vote to decide what will be reviewed on this channel. I've been wanting to do more of these this year, so let's get one started. Just a reminder, you do need to be a supporter on Patreon in order to vote, so please check out my Patreon to find out how. Support at any level gives you the vote. This time around, I wanted to focus on small play sets because I don't think they get enough love. In 1984, we got three battle stations in the G.I. Joe line, and those will be your options for this month's vote. Option one will be the 1984 Bivouac. This is a set I had as a kid, and I recall liking it a lot. This is a set with a lot of parts, so there will be a lot to talk about. So if you'd like to see a review of the 1984 Bivouac, go to Patreon and choose option one. Option two will be the 1984 Mountain Howitzer. This set was designed to be used in conjunction with G.I. Joe vehicles. It could be towed. This is actually a weapon, so if you want to see a more action-oriented review and you'd like to see the Mountain Howitzer, select option two. Option three will be the 1984 Watchtower. This is another one I had as a kid and I really liked it. Uh, this one could be a challenge. This is a very tall set with the flag on top so it could be a challenge to review it and get the whole thing in the camera frame so if you'd like to see me challenged by a review of the watchtower select option three i really like these play sets because they were small and inexpensive not every kid had the money or the space to get one of the large sprawling play sets so these sets meant that any fan of gi joe could have a small play set to to add to their play battles. So once again, just go over to Patreon to find out how to vote. Support at any level gives you the right to vote. Voting will start as soon as you see this video go up, which will be on March 4th. The voting will end on March 8th, and the winning video will go up on March 24th. So get started and pick your favorite. The voting starts now.